This is the 2020 Math Kangaroo Levels 3-4 Prom Number 22. Several teams came to the Summer Kangaroo Camp. Each team has five or six members. There are 43 people in total. How many teams are at this camp? A. 9 B. 8 C. 7 D. 6 or E. 4 this is the problem as it originally appeared on the test, and here is where we'll be doing the solution. So to start, we have each team has either five or six members, but we don't know how many teams we have of five people or how many teams of six people we have. That's what we're trying to figure out. So we'll have a certain amount of teams with five people, and that number of five people teams times five people per team plus another number of teams times six people per team will give us a total of 43 people in total. So let's try to figure out if we can see any patterns. Starting with fives. So here are some multiples of five. What do you notice about their ones places? The last digit. Well, we can see that they either end in five or in zero. Let's say for our first um, option, let's say that our number, our multiple of five ends in zero. So we don't really need to worry about the tens digit for now. Let's just focus on the ones digit. So again, our multiple of five has a ones digit of zero. And then we're adding another number to it. And we have to end up with 43. So the ones digit of our sum is three. That means that our ones digit over here must be what? Well, it must be three if we want to have a sum with a ones digit of three. But if we look at multiples of six, and you can look way beyond this list, you'll never have a multiple of six that has a ones digit of three, because six is an even number. So you'll, again, never end with a three. So that means that this isn't possible. Our multiple of five is not going to end in zero. Let's see what happens if it ends in five. Because again, it can either end in five or zero. So if we wanna end with this three, the ones digit of our sum, this number must be eight. And again, let's look at our multiples of six that I've written over here. And again, I've just written the multiples of five and six down just so that we can reference them easily. But again, you would have them memorized during the test, so you would not need to write them down then. You would just remember what they are. So let's look at our list of sixes over here. Where do we see a multiple of six that has a ones digit of eight that's less than 43? We have 18 right there. So our multiple of 6 is 18. What's 43 minus 18? Well, you can see that that's 25. So our multiple of 5 is 25. So how many teams do we have? We have 5 teams of 5. And we have three teams of six. So five plus three gives us a total of eight teams, which is answer choice B. Thank you so much for watching, and please subscribe if you'd like to see more videos.